In a bit to reduce its carbon footprint, China is trying to replace the burning of traditional fossil fuels with electrical initiatives. Zheng Yibin reports on the changes taking place. It's yet another smoggy day for Beijing. Extensive burning of fossil fuels means the Chinese capital seldom sees blue skies, and it only gets worse in winter. In a bid to address this problem, the country is taking various approaches that includes using electricity as a replacement. The electricity vehicle, or EV, is one of them. This type of car has clean energy and spends only about one yuan for about a four-kilometer drive. That's at least half the amount of conventional cars. But unlike going to the petrol station to refuel, EV users find it hard to charge their cars. To solve this problem, more charging posts are being built, and a smart center has just opened in Beijing. The country is only for monitoring and providing EV charging services now. It helps to locate the nearest and available poles instantly. Users will soon charge their cars within one kilometer in downtown, three kilometers in suburbs, and five kilometers in outer suburb areas. With the guiding system, things are getting easier. In Beijing, apart from the electric vehicles, there are other power replacement programs going on. One example is the use of electricity to replace coal at home and in industry. Such efforts focus on the old and inefficient coal-burning facilities like cooking, heating, and manufacturing. Since 2003, we have had over 650,000 conversions in Beijing. In central Beijing, we can see no trace of coal-burning systems, and we are planning more conversions. This could save close to two million tons of standard coal each year. Besides these conversions. The state grid is taking clean energy from wind, water, and solar power from the central and western regions, and transmitting it to eastern areas, including Beijing. These changes may not be so noticeable yet, but change is taking place. Zheng Yibin, CCTV, Beijing.